Microphone's on. Which one are we doing first? We've got video. Um, probably 21 Bridges. So, uh, actually, do we want to talk about He-Man? <laughs> oh, we should talk about He-Man a little bit here, man. What's that kid's name? No, Noah something? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Let's see. Noah Centineo? Um, yeah, I, I, I have seen him. He's been in one of my wife's TV shows, The Fosters. He he to me. Is, I will give you this. He's adequate, but he's not a leading role type. That he's I, not big enough to play He-Man. No. no, not at all. And number number two is he just has that that little kid Disney look to him. He has a charming Disney he's character. Got, he, I'm sure he's probably been on a Disney show or something at oh, some point. Jesus Christ, you know they already updated the wiki to show his picture? Yeah, they I, didn't waste any time, did they? And he, he man's blonde. This guy's obviously now a brunette. Die, yeah. And, die yeah, I don't care. Imagine that guy blonde. It's not gonna look right. I know, it is, it is a little weird. I mean, I... We've been wrong a few times about some actors, but I don't know. It's, yeah, it's don't know. definitely throws me off seeing that kid's face next to He-Man. I mean, I grew up with He-Man. That was yep. the cartoon I loved as a kid. Skeletor. It's probably you did too, didn't you? Who should play Skeletor? I think I think the guy that played, uh, oh, what was it? Scarecrow? Red or Scare Scarecrow. Scarecrow yeah. in uh, Batman. I think he'd, that he'd, he'd make a good, good Skeletor. He'd be pretty good. He She-Ra like and Orko. Yeah, I wonder how far they're going to go with this. you think they'll bring out the Thundercats and all the rest of them? Honestly, just to be <laughs> truthful, I mean, I don't know what they were thinking. Maybe thinking they could bring some females into the audience because I know girls are into them. But I don't think guys are going to want to go see him. No, I don't think this is this is probably going to fail epically with all and genders and age groups and everything. Who are they making this for? The people that remember He-Man are in their f like mid-30s and 40s and up. So it's hmm. like... You got a guy that looks like he's from Teen Disney. I mean, I would have rather seen Dolph Lundgren play the part again. Oh, absolutely. Old as shit. Hands down. Please, all of you. Choice, really choice. What is this, a circus act? Now somebody's gonna give me some answers around here. Let's start with you, Blondie. Or why not Why not even that one guy who was the boxer in uh, Creed that would play his son? He's big enough. Yeah. He would have made a great He-Man. I don't really know about his acting Buddy. ability. You could you could cast Jeff Bridges and it'd be better. Okay, yeah. I mean I have a real hard time with this. <laughs> I mean it's it's so terrible looking. I don't know. I just eh, anyway. Yeah, I agree. So anyway, <laughs> back moving to our, on now. Back to our regularly scheduled program. Hey everybody, this is Mike, and this of course is Larry, and we are the Movie Cranks. Tonight we are going to be looking at a new trailer from the new movie coming out, 21 Bridges. Okay, so this is 21 Bridges. Larry, tell me tell me something about it. We'll start with Chadwick Boseman as a cop. He uh, his dad who would had been killed when he was younger. Oh, okay. Yeah, and apparently there's some cop killers on the loose and he's out to get them, and to catch them, they shut down all 17 bridges and four tunnels Ooh. and going in and out of Manhattan. Oh, man. It sounds pretty crazy, man. That would be a heck of a task. Is he a cop too? Yeah, no, he's supposed to be like some kind of, I don't know, he's, I don't think he's FBI. But he's some kind of special Oh, like a task force agent, agent or, or something, something like that? Okay. Well, I mean, so far, we've got good actor. Bozeman has proven himself with the Avengers. Um, like said, he's J. also J.K. Simmons is. Oh, uh, J.K. Simmons is in this. <laughs> Absolutely, J.K. Simmons, and we have one of your favorites, Taylor, Taylor Kitsch. <laughs> I'm sorry, man. I, I like John Carter. I know you, he told me before you shouldn't say that, it, and, but you'll you'll get grilled. But I enjoy John Carter. Uh, he's made some other good movies like Lone Survivor. You know. It's a fun, stupid movie. It was movie. a Friday Night's Lights, which was on TV for yeah, a while. Yeah, Friday Night Lights was a, a favorite for a lot of people. I mean, my wife no, liked no. that, too. No. <laughs> Battleship, though? Battleship. We're going in. So, that, that wasn't as good. It's entertaining, no. though. It was stupid entertainment, once stupid. again. Yeah, yeah, it's in that same category. Uh, Stefan James, who hasn't had a huge library of movies and TV shows yet, but uh, still was uh, Selma. Um, shots fired. I think there was one more. Oh, Homecoming. And, of course, the ever-beautiful Sienna, Sienna Miller. Miller. So, who was uh, Layer Cake, G.I. Joe, 
Um, and what else we got? Uh, she was in Alfie and American Sniper as well. So all in all, pretty good actresses and actors. Um, I have not seen this trailer at all. Um, I had no idea what this is about. I know we saw a clip of it in Avengers, but we got in right when it was going on. So I didn't see much. Right at the end. So anyway, what do you think? Wanna check this thing out? Let's get this one started up, guys. Okay. Get my headset on here. This time I actually didn't get tangled up in it. Good job. Oh, good job. I knew you could do it. <laughs> Your father died protecting this city. Oh, that's cool. To follow your conscience in an often cruel world. What happened? Worst day in 18 years. How many cops? Eight. Why were they here? They responded to a robbery. Oh, man. Shot fired! Shot fired! Officers are down! Automatic weapons, two shooters. Oh. We have training. How old were you when your father's captain came? I asked for you for a reason. I will find it. We just killed cops. You need to run. We gotta move fast. Cars not ours. Plates are stolen. Oh, they're they're working yeah. together. These guys in the next nice. three four hours, they vanish. How are you gonna do this? Close the island. Got 21 bridges in and out of Manhattan. Shut them down. Three rivers. Close them. Four tunnels. Block them. Stop every train and loop the subways. Then. We flood the island with blow. Mask on, Scott. Your mask on. None of this makes sense. The bid was for 30 keys. We walked into 300. Damn, it's a lot of drugs. <laughs> mask on, Scott. Your mask on. They'll have to open Manhattan by morning. Eight dead policemen is one thing, but the stock market losing billions of dollars is quite another. Oh, I see. This whole thing is filthy. You know what I mean? You gotta be to move 300 kilos of cocaine. Oh, my God. What's going on here? I just need the truth, that's all. They told me you were fearless. The guy who kills cop killers. Sees his dad and every cop who dies. Nobody approaching? He's mine! Police, out of the way, move! They're not gonna escape oh. this island. You're the only cop tonight who speaks first and shoots second. I will find out why didn't I happen. I like the tone of that trailer. Yeah. It just has a good a good feel to it. Of course it's Anthony and Joe Russo, isn't that their names? Uh, the Russo brothers. Yeah, yeah I forgot Anthony. to bring that up. This is the same guys that worked with him in the Avengers in, movies. In game. So they yeah, we already know how to have, put together a good movie. And, and you know what? That's part of the that's part of the big thing. We got directors and writers that know each other and and work together. That that changes everything. So we've seen other movies like this in the past. We've got Bruce Willis. And he did that 16, 16 blocks. blocks. And uh, you had mentioned the Stallone one. Uh, Copland? Copland. And Copland was a good one, too. I mean, Sylvester Stallone was like reignited him, you know. Yeah. But that this has kind of following that same pattern. Yeah, but got them tone. it looks really good. I mean, we got scenes here from the beginning. You got the, the, the father's funeral, you know, with the kid crying. I mean, that's, that's never a good way to start things off. Uh, uh, I don't think a good way <laughs> would be to close 16 bridges and, or we know, 17 bridges and four tunnels. Yeah. Can you imagine be, what that would do to, that, it would, to the city? It would, people would be panicking, I would think. Oh. I mean, I don't know what people would be doing. Be wanting, I mean, there's so be many people that live in Jersey and other places that would be just trapped and yeah. couldn't get home to their families. I mean, yeah, eight officers being killed. I mean, this scene that shows the officers responding to the... Uh, the, I guess the break-in. It looks like a wine store. Um, it, the shootout in there was yeah, it looked pretty good. Pretty Lots visceral. Of, I mean, it was like those, in your did face. You see all those little bullets and everything just sitting yeah. everywhere. I mean, they laid it out. They do a lot of nice city shots of New York. Uh, drone shots, helicopter. I mean, they, it, the city looks amazing. No, it looks like it's been shot really good. Yeah, I mean, there's some really neat, like the scenes where they're in the car with all the police cars going down the bridge. I mean, there's some beautiful looking cinematography. I don't even know who is doing the, the camera work, but in right here, that directors of Infinity War, War Captain Marvel, all these <laughs> other ones. And 
Oh, what's the other guy? I might just say the Russo the brothers. The Russo brothers. Yeah. yeah. Um, how do you? What do you think of him being teamed up? Well, I already, I'm already getting a vibe out of this, okay? And I, I'm, I'm laying out a theory already. Not a comedy. They're not going to be bad guys. No, no. They're, they're going to be guys who somehow just got caught up in something that was just bigger than them. And I know where it's going, man. And there's going to be a lot of, like, conspiracy and mm -hmm. bad cops and all that kind of stuff. Now, this part in the subway was interesting where he said, hey, I, you're the guy that doesn't shoot first. You know, and asks questions first, basically. Are you thinking they're trying to say something? Well, that's, like that's why message? I think that's, that's what I think they're going with there. Yeah. But these guys, because he even says to them, I will find out how this happened or what happened. Yep. And you got the guy, you got one of the guys in front of you that actually apparently was the one that did it. Well, do you think they're setting him up? So I think it's some kind of setup. Yeah, like they expected and him it's gonna to go deeper to kill He's going to undercover conspiracies yeah. and all that kind of stuff. It, it's going to be one of those where, I, I mean, we've seen some like that with Sam Jackson. Yeah. Like I said, it's going to link bad cops. Yeah. Well, Sam Jackson, they set him up in that uh, movie to where they they figured he would follow along but, with their plan. Yeah, we, a lot of us have seen this movie a lot. Yeah. Movies like this. But, you know, Chadwick Boseman, I think I'm, I kind of want to see what he's going to bring to it. Uh, the music was great, too. The music was perfect. Good tone for the trailer. Real light. It wasn't crazy flashy in your face or anything. No. Um, I mean, it, it was really well done. Excited about this one. This is, could be one of the ones we've never even thought of or heard of. When does it come out? Uh, we is got the summer movie this or this somewhere a, here. It's maybe a fall movie because this is like a oh July. July. So July twelfth is when this one comes out. Uh, if you haven't watched the trailer, go ahead and check it out. But uh, there's definitely some promise here. I think we have needed. You know what? We need, we need a, a good movie pop like, movie. Yeah, we need a movie like this. We haven't had one yeah. in a couple years. Yeah, I mean, all in all, I mean, I'd be happy as hell to see another good cop movie. Yeah, so. seemed like the last one I seen that I really like was the one with Mark Wahlberg, which is another one that looks similar to this. Yeah. So. Yep. Well, I think that's about all we got, guys, for now. So yep. don't forget to check us out on Facebook, Twitter, we got Instagram. Yeah. All that good stuff. Sending all of our love out to all of our new Facebook people. We just passed 330 in a matter of a week, which means we could be in the tens of thousands in a month or two. Hopefully. So that would be insane. Hopefully, some of you on Facebook will check out our YouTube page too and subscribe yeah. to us there. Please. Yes, because that always helps. <laughs> <laughs> Go to our actual videos and like them and watch them and subscribe. Yes. So that's what, that's what exactly. we need. But until next time, guys, I think we're going to get out. Uh, yep. We got one more trailer coming up. We're going to do Sonic. So check that one out too. But until next time, guys, see ya. Peace.